You're watching the Southland's number one news, the Channel 4 News at 4.30. Tai Bo, it's the popular exercise that combines karate and dance, and it has thousands of followers. But boxing superstar Sugar Ray Leonard, not one of them. He's suing over the use of his name in a promotional video. And this afternoon, Tai Bo is in a legal tangle. Good afternoon once again. I'm Kim Baldonado. And I'm Chuck Henry. Sugar Ray Leonard says it is not the money, it's his name that's at stake. Manny Medrano spoke with him exclusively and has more from the newsroom. Manny? Thank you, Chuck. Well, as we all know, Sugar Ray Leonard is a boxing icon. He is known worldwide, and the superstar athlete says that he has spent his entire life developing his name and his reputation. Well, now Leonard is suing the producers of a Thai book infomercial for using his name without his permission. Today, in an exclusive inter interview, Sugar Ray Leonard told me why he's taking on Taibo. No one has a right to use anyone's name without their permission. It's plain and simple. Boxing legend Sugar Ray Leonard uh, is mad. He says the marketers of this Taibo infomercial used his name without authorization. Taibo has become like a huge sensation, attracting people like Sugar Ray Leonard. Taibo, of course, is the workout pioneered by karate champ Billy Blanks that combines martial arts and dancing. The exercise videotapes have been phenomenally successful thanks to plugs from celebrities like Sinbad, Shaquille O'Neal, and Wayne Gretzky. But Sugar Ray Leonard says that his name was used to endorse Taibo without his permission. I've worked years, over 20-some years, to give my name some value. Um, and it's been used without my permission. So that does bother me a great deal. Sugar Ray Leonard worked very hard for over a quarter of a century to develop that name. And it's not fair for somebody to come in and steal it and think they can get away with it. Well, they can't get away with it. Sugar Ray says that there's more than money at stake here. I stand uh, not only to protect myself, but to protect the young athletes that are coming up after me. People work, train, sacrifice too hard, too long, to create a name that is of value for a person to outright steal it. Now, it's important to note that Tybo instructor Billy Blanks is not being sued by Sugar Ray Leonard. Rather, it's the producer of the infomercial that is being sued. And the attorney for that producer told me today that they dispute all of Leonard's allegations, that the First Amendment allows the use of Leonard's name, and that the producer expects to be fully vindicated at trial. Chuck, Kim, back to you in the, new, in the, in the studio now.